suppose you think that was terribly clever. Come on, Gandalf. Did you see their faces? There are many magic rings in this world, Bilbo Baggins, and none of them should be used lightly. It was just a bit of fun. Oh, you're probably right, as usual. You will keep an eye on Frodo, won't you? Two eyes. Yes. As often as I can spare them. I'm leaving everything to him. What about this ring of yours? Is that staying too? Yes, yes. Say an envelope over there on the mantelpiece. No. Wait, it's... here in my pocket. <laughs> Isn't that... isn't that odd now? Yeah. After all, why not? Why shouldn't I keep it? I think you should leave the ring behind, Bilbo. Is that so hard? Well, no. And yes. Now it comes to it. I don't feel like parting with it. It's mine. I found it. It came to me. There's no need to get angry. Well, if I'm angry, it's your fault. It's mine. My own. My precious. Precious? It's been called that before, but not by you. How? Oh, what business is it of yours when I do with my own things? I think you've had that ring quite long enough. You want it for yourself? Come on, Baggins! Do not take me for some conjurer of cheap tricks. I am not trying to rob you. I'm trying to help you. Oh. All your long years, we've been friends. Trust me, as you once did. Let it go. You're right, Gandalf. The ring must go to Frodo. It's late. The road is long. Yes, it is time. Bilbo. Hmm? The ring is still in your pocket. Have him. Yes. I've thought up an ending for my book. And he lived happily ever after, to the end of his days. And I'm sure you will, my dear friend. Goodbye, Gandalf. Goodbye, dear Bubba. Ever and on the door. Until our next meeting.